Okay guys, so welcome back. This is going to be step 2, part A. We are going to be doing um, the level 1 and the level 2 um, ice challenges. And uh, for this you're going to need to go into the elemental plane. Uh, now this, uh, you need to check my channel and I will show you my notepad which has the decoding of all of the symbols that I'm about to use. Um, now I went through the wind portal because that is the one closest to spawn. Um, okay, so we have three dots here. If I look at my notepad quickly, um, it will show me that three dots with the, the one dot facing right. It is an I with a T. And that will flip and he will say something. The four dots is an L with a floating triangle. Okay, uh, this one is an L and a T. It is alone to choose. And the two dots are the eye and the floating triangle and this one is uh, uh, hold on I'm missing it yeah there we go is I L and obviously by process of elimination the last one is the low part you know not what we have you are closer so much closer there we go, and again, I should have built the portal when it came through. So that is the level one, as I call it. There are two, there are, there are, uh, two challenges for each staff. Um, four, uh, one challenge of each staff is in this dimension, and the other challenges for the staffs are in the reality world. So I call that one basic, that one level one, all the basic challenges, and these are the level two or higher challenges. So uh, what you, need, you now need to do once you've completed the level one challenges, uh, waterfalls or tombstones. I think that I, th I think they're waterfalls because I mean, what tombstone has a continuous water flowing over it? Um, you need to shoot the ice star and switch to any regular weapon and shoot it and make it shatter. And the first one is by Juggernaut. Uh, the second one is not very far away at all. It is just here by Pack Punch. Shoot, switch, and shoot again. And the last one is the furthest away. And that one is by the dead um, robot's arm, which is by the tank station. Best way to do it, uh, the best way to get to it, is to go back into the uh, workshop, uh, go to the lower floor, and go into the tank station and go out the back door. Giggity. And um, you will see the dead robot with his hand fall on the floor, and to the left of his hand, uh, there will be another one of those waterfallish, tombstoneish pieces of objects. So there you go, it is right there and uh, it's something you need to run up to it. The ice has a certain distance so you can't shoot it from like here to over there. You have to be quite close for the ice to hit. Freeze, shoot. Now, to do it correctly, there will be a beam of light and she will speak uh, and there will be a beam of light that comes down and that will place a um, blue orb at the bottom of the pack punch. So uh, just to prove this, I will see you back at Pack Punch to show you all. Right guys, welcome back. Uh, we're back in the uh, staff room and if you look up now, there will be this blue beam of, uh, sorry, sorry, this blue orb of light. And um, we are going to show you how to complete this uh, final step. You need to use the four levers that I'm going to show you to align the rings so that they are all blue. Uh, so that one controls the second one down. Um, uh, this one controls the very top ring and you need to turn that to blue and uh, as you can see uh, the crystal, the pure crystal area is now hovering above the blue orb and uh, if I actually walk up the steps that would help and you need to turn this one again till it's blue and finally you need to, there's a way to cheat on this one and just jump and hit it there we go and one more there we go and all you simply do now is boom, shine, and it'll fly up. The rings will reset, and that is the ice staff fully completed now, ready to be upgraded. Upgraded in step three. So thank you very much. Uh, join us next episode, and I'll show you how to um, complete all the sorry the basic and higher challenges for the wind staff. Thank you very much. Please like and comment. Let me know. Talk to me. I like replying to you guys. And subscribe if you like everything and all the content I'm producing. It's been a pleasure. Guardians out.